the National Colored Congress is the only party with a manifesto that is written specifically for the need of the colored people. It is a very simple manifesto. It's the shortest one in the country. It speaks directly to our needs. The manifesto has only a few points. It's been designed for the man in the street. You see, as a party that is almost new, we are as frustrated as the general populace with regards to manifestos and manifesto launches. They're generally nothing but problem promises. And with these manifestos come the problem of expectation. Ours is a manifesto that we know everything in it can be implemented and attained over a five-year period. We don't talk pie in the sky. The manifesto excuse me, deals with our simplest and most basic issues, like crime, like unemployment, like housing, like access to resource, like land expropriation, like an end to gang violence. We talk about social development on a level that no one else does because no one else understands the colored people quite like us. In this party, we have a very, very simple slogan. Colored lives matter. That should wrap up the entire manifesto. If there are any manifesto questions, I'm very happy to answer them. But I'll end with saying that it's a manifesto like no other. I can tell you this. Most of the parties sitting to the left of me have had manifesto launches. Let's ask them where are the results. If you want to understand the NCC manifesto, come and, look at our, come and look at our work. We are the only party that works for the colored people without a pause. When colored people needed work, we shut down businesses that refused to employ us, government departments that refused to employ us. When there are gang wars raging on the Cape Flats, it is the National Colored Congress that puts a stop to it. When colored children couldn't get into schools in the Western Cape, it was our members that forced people, that forced young kids into school. When there's a housing crisis on the Cape Flats and colored people are being overlooked for their housing rights, it is us who shut down the city of Cape Town. This is not a party of talk, no marketing, no gimmicks, all about truth. Let me tell you, we are so hard on corruption that out of the 12 parties sitting here, we are proud to say we are the only party in this country that has our government, the Democratic Alliance, in court on fraud and corruption. Now let me say it again. In 18 years, the Democratic Alliance has never been found to have stolen a cent. The National Colored Congress, within its first six months in council, put them in the dock for 500 million. Thank you.